it's me, Delianne, and I'm so excited because I'm here for my yearly I'm at Tall video. So I'm so excited. I got so much, like I've gotten so much more than any other year this year. So awesome. And um, so yeah, I don't want to make this like a super long video. So I'm just going to get right to it because I know it's going to be long. And then um, for the IMATS vlog, I'll just do like an intro or something if I want to do something for the IMATS vlog because I will be posting that up this year. So sorry I didn't do it last year. So yeah, let's just get right into it. Okay, so I'm not going to go in order of like the places that I went. I'll just show you the stuff that I got, okay? Um, so I went, I don't know where, but um, they sold Ben Nye. And so I got the Ben, ben Nye Neutral Set Colorless Powder. And if I'll remember the prices, I'll definitely tell you. This was $6.50 for this uh, small bottle. So I, what I'm gonna use this, a lot of uh, the stuff that I got was for my kit. And what I'll be using this for is um, to set the to set the makeup. So I'll just brush it over so the person doesn't get oily or whatever. And the next place I went to was Splash. These were five for 30, the glitters. I'll take them out so you guys can see them. This one is Starlight Red. I wanted like a pretty red glitter and I don't really use glitter so that's why I was I wanted to start using them. Isn't that so pretty? So the so same pretty. reason I want to this LA Splash was for glitters because I really wanted to try the glitters out. This one is Pacific Ocean. It's so pretty. It has like it's just mainly like blue. I don't see any other colors in there. So pretty, right? And then this one has little um, yellow and green and blue. And that's Silver Wave. So you guys could see that. I'm trying to block out the sun. Okay. And then this one is Tropical Lime. Maybe I should open it for you guys. Okay, so that one is Tropical Lime. Isn't that so pretty? Like, I could do, like, some mermaid looks with that one. And the last one, of course, I need a gold color. This one is Golden Seahorse. So I guess they're going with all, like, ocean themes. Oh, I can't wait. I can't and wait. the next place I went to was Second Love. And if you wanted to follow them on uh there's all their stuff if you guys want to follow them anywhere and at second love they did give me um um all i got there was this concealer foundation so i could use it as a concealer foundation and i got it in the light the light color Yep, and then I did get these two makeup remover cleaners. I'm going to use one for myself and one for my kit. So those, and I got one in cucumber and one in rose. And they did give me a complimentary gift. And that's, this isn't that cute, like the little cute packaging. And let me open it up so I can show you. They gave me a lipstick. It's not open yet, but it's in Cupid. And they also gave me a cream gel. And it looks like it's a cream gel eyeshadow. And I think the color is angelic, but it looks like a gray. So yeah, that's the color. Pretty. Okay, so the next place I went to was Softbox, my favorite place ever. So here is um, their Softbox. That's the little card that they gave me inside. And they didn't have the Forbidden Fruits. That was on my list, so I'll have to keep adding it on my list, list for next year. And this is their um, Creme de la Creme palette. And isn't it cute? Like, ugh, their packaging is so cute. I just absolutely love Saucebox. So pretty. 
but yeah so let me try to take it out and here is the front of it and there are the colors the I'm gonna start with this one right here that one is future then the next one inception then the next one over is seashell then down here that one's black widow then the middle is secrecy and the last one the list last white color is rain I just love them I love absolutely love sauce box because they're so pigmented they're so pretty such pretty colors love them I have almost all the palettes except for that one but hopefully next year I'll be able to get it on to the next was Morphe okay so that line was ridiculous but well worth it absolutely love Morphe okay so here's my first one that I'm gonna show you and I believe this is there brow palette and they have it like really secure so it doesn't break so that's good and here's the packaging yep it's their brow palette and it looks like this and I think this right here is like um, it could be the wax or um, concealer to conceal I think it's a concealer isn't that so pretty? I've gotten their other brow palette, and this one is, like, so much better. So I love it. Okay. Next, I'm going to go on. This is the next palette I got. I believe this is the concealer palette. Yes. So I'm hitting pan on all of my top colors, except the this one that's my that's the one that I use for my brows but all the other ones all the lighter shades I'm hitting pan because that's what I use um, for a highlight underneath my eye so yeah I needed this okay and then the next palette hopefully they have the name it just says 35C but it's Oh yeah, so this was my matte color. So um, one of the makeup artists always says that we need to have like a matte palette because um, cause it's just better like on brides and stuff. So that's why I always try to get matte. And then um, I also have my neutral palette and with shimmer and stuff as well. So if they want glitter, you know. But here, it's always easier to use matte. So that's why I got this palette for my kit. And then, here's another palette. I think this is also matte. Yeah, here is another. No, this one. I forgot. Oh, I wish I would have remembered their name. But this is, I believe, the 35B. And it... I just love the colors like aren't they so pretty and vibrant so pretty so that's why I got it I just got and this one has looks like for every they have um, they have shimmer and matte so that's good I'll probably use that one myself because it is so pretty oh and this one Jacqueline Hill favorites. I've been seeing it all over YouTube. Is it on that? Yeah. Just the back is upside down. Okay. So this is the Jacqueline Hill palette. Everybody has been talking about it, raving about it. So I had to get my hands on this palette. So I'll show you guys. And I'll definitely do a look for you guys because it's just so pretty. I could open it so I'm so excited to get my hands on it isn't it pretty and I could do like so many different looks with this palette I absolutely love it and this is my last palette that I got 
I was just looking at all the palettes and I absolutely love them. I think this is like my warm. It's the 35N, I believe. Yeah, this is like the matte. I needed a matte warm colors. This is definitely going to work for brides, special occasions, because these are the colors that they usually like. So this is definitely a must in my kit. Okay, now on to brushes. All of my brushes that I got this time, they're going to be for my kit. So I got a lot of brushes. So this one is the Morphe MB33. And that's what it looks like. Let me take it out. And this one, you guys know I love this brush to do my contouring. I always do it in all my videos, so I got this one. And I love it because it looks so sleek because it's black, so. Yeah, and it's the Morphe and the 3-3. So if you guys are interested, go online. And then um, I needed a foundation brush. So I got this one. It doesn't have a name, but it sort of looks like my uh, brush that I use for my foundation. And I like to use a fluffy brush to put on my foundation. I think it blends it really well. So that's why I got this one. The next one is the Morphe G4. And it looks like this. I'm going to be using this mostly for my blushes. I like an angled brush. I think it works better for me because I just go in and um, I do it at an angle. So it just works better. And this one is just a small smudger, br smudger brush. I don't know why I can't say my words pronunciate correctly. But yeah, this is the Morphe. MB16, if you guys could see that. And it's just, I, I could do like a smoky eye with this, you know, different things. And then this one I thought was so interesting. This one is just a really huge smudger brush. It's like that one, but like huge. So yeah. And then... Here's, I was looking for like a nice eyeliner brush. Um, this is the Morphe G29. So I just wanted a eyeliner. Or I could also, I like to use these also to put in um, at your eyebrows. Um, actually, this one I like a little bit more for the eyebrows. It's the M160, I believe, one something, something going on there. And then, look at how little that is. Perfect. And then, I think there's one more in here. And this is the Morphe G29. Another eyeliner brush. Dang, I didn't realize how many eyeliner brushes I got. And that's not the last one. Oh, yes. This one. So... If I want a more defined contour, I got this brush. I've seen many YouTubers use it, so I wanted to get my hands on it, and it's the Morphe MB30. So in total, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, six palettes. So I'll definitely be using those throughout the year and definitely let you know what I think about them. So next I'm going to go to NYX and they gave me a really cute little bag. And that's so cute. I love, love, love how they give reusable bags. They're, they're my favorite. Okay, so I'll start off with the, I'll show you all the lipsticks last because I got a lot. I really wanted like that was one thing I had in my mind and I think I overdid it but some for me some for my mom and some for my kid so yeah okay so this is the 
This is the NYX Powder Foundation, and I got it in the golden beige. So that's that. And then I'll take it out so I could show you guys. Oh, cute. So that's the front. And then there's the golden beige. And then I'll take out the... And then it comes with the little a little thing but I'll probably not use it I'll just toss it so yeah that's that one two foundation one is um, a stay matte one is full coverage is um, the regular one so this one is the full coverage and I got it in honey beige um, yeah I guess the INF 10 I don't know what that means, but yeah, it's in honey beige, so that's what that looks like. Can't wait to try it. And then them. I got the NYX Stay Matte, but not flat. I got this in a color tan, and that that is SMF09. So yeah, I got that one. Okay, and the next thing I got was the mascara. This is the packaging. It's a doll eye mascara. And I'm going to show you the wand. So yeah, this is supposed to be for volumizing. And it looks like a pretty good wand. I'll definitely let you know what I think on Instagram. If you guys don't already follow me there, my name is Delia Ann 6 on Instagram. And I'll definitely put it in the bottom. I always do. So make sure to follow me if you guys want to know what I think. And the next products. thing that I've been wanting to try is the eyeshadow base. And this is a white one. I think it's so pretty. I've seen a lot of other people use it. So I'm excited to try it. So yeah, I got the white one. And then I got four. I got four mascaras. So this is in... Borgus Pig, I guess, and this is like a pretty, pretty pink color with a little bit of red. It's on the darker side, so yeah, that's pretty. And then I got this one, which is um, Terracotta, and this one, it has a little more blush. This is more to the bronzer side. Sorry, this... You guys could see that a little bit that glare I'm sorry guys and then this is another this is dusty rose okay so this is dusty rose and that's a pretty rose colored it's on the darker side as well and the last one is pinky rose so pretty i'm so excited to be getting i'm gonna give two to my mom and two for myself so she could have one and the next colors i got were the jumbo eye pencils and i like to use these for um as a base so of course i got the one in milk that's the white one and then I got this one too. It's a blue color and this one is called Cobalt. So that's the blue one. And then this is the closest one that they had to like a darker color. And that's Night Cavalier. So that one. And then we're on to the lipsticks. So. These are a lot. I got a total, let's count them. I got a total of 16 lipsticks, wow. Okay, so the first one I'm gonna show you, I'm not gonna take them out of the packaging because it would just be too much. So this one is, I believe it's called Immortal and this is from their Wicked, their Wicked collection. It's a purple and I've really wanted to get like fun colors so I can't wait to try that. Then the next one, this one is open so I'm gonna show you that one. And this is the matte from their matte collection. And this is Summer Breeze. I don't like, um, 
I'm really into right now, the matte lipstick, so that's why I got that. And then the next one is open as well. This is another matte, and this one is Forbidden. I'll just say it's Forbidden. So, and this is like a nude, I would say. With a, yeah, it's a nude. And then the next one is, oh, I already opened that one. Okay, and the next one is Sweet Street Cred. So, and this is like, looks like a pink color. It's coming a little darker on the thing. This is like a darker red. And this is called Angel. And this one is Natural. So yeah, if you guys want to see like a separate video on these, I'll definitely swatch them for you and show them. So if you guys are interested, just leave a comment down below. Even one comment, like I'll do it. So anybody comment? <laughs> Got another one of the naturals. One for me and one for my mom, I think. And then I got an MLS, oh, Merlot. So that one's Merlot. And then this one's Alabama, I already have this one. Alabama. And then this one's Audrey. It's like a super cute pink color. If you guys could see that. Audrey. And then I got an NYX Hot Couture, but it's like spelled differently. And then there's the color. And then I got Daydream. Whipped Caviar. That sounds interesting. So that's Whipped Caviar. This one is Shocking Pink. And it looks like a bright pink with a little bit of purple. Then I got Shy Timid. This is like a nude, another nude. And then I got Aria. And this is like a purple, but not as dark as the Wicked one. It's like a, this is more like a purple blue. Okay, so that's all the stuff that I got from NYX, a lot. Next I went to BH Cosmetics, and is it this? This is the bag that they always give out, so cute, love it. Okay, and I only got a couple of things because I had a very long list but they didn't have anything that I wanted. So I was like sort of upset. So I was just like going down my list. Do you have this? No. So I was just crossing it off. It was so funny. But I got two of their liquid eyeliners. I got one in violet. And yeah, this is the violet one. I'll show you guys the eyeliner. So yeah, if you guys can see that it's a little bit violet so I'll swatch it for you guys so there it is that's the violet one and then I'll swatch the so yeah that's Ooh, why did I put it on the weird side of my hand so that's the one so you guys could see Okay, okay. The next thing I got was the BH Party Girl After Hours. I've been wanting to get this. I see it everywhere. It's so pretty. Aren't these like, and they have both matte and shimmer colors. You guys would see, so pretty. And then I wanted to get... This is going to be for my kit, a contour and blush palette. 
definitely always need more. And I just like to try different products so I can see what they're all about. So that's the palette. And then I also got the the um Remember when I was doing my haul, if you guys watched my BH Cos Mother's Day haul, I told you guys that I should have got this one and I finally got it. I'm so excited. It's the matte bombshell bronzer and it's all in one color and it's so pretty. Oh, this is the one that I wanted so much. So I'm excited I got to get it this time at Highmat. And I believe this is in the color Diva. So yeah, if you guys are interested, there's Diva. And then I wanted to try their matte finish press powder. So I got that. That's the packaging and here's the front of it. And I got it in shade number 235. So that's my shade. So that's the color, super pretty can't wait to try it and this one also comes with the sponge as well okay so my BH my BH um haul was not as big as I anticipated but oh well and hopefully next year at IMAPS they'll have the other palettes that I wanted or I'll just get it online the next place I went to was crown brush and this is their little bag and I'll show you guys the brushes first and the lip liners after so that's um I saw I was also really into lip liners I needed more lip liners for my kit also for me as well so I wanted to get some of those and the first brush that I'm going to show you is a kabuki so that's that that's what that looks like so what I would use this for is if like a client is really oily I'll just go in in those areas make sure it gets packed on really well so she doesn't get oily the next brush is an IB 109 chisel fluff so that's that one the next one is, I like this one a lot, and I know I'll be using it. It's a BK51 Bent Liner, so that's that one. I know this is going to be like uh, my go-to eyeliner brush, because it just looks so nice. And this one is my, it doesn't say anything, but it's um, sometimes put on liquid foundation, and sometimes they leave streaks. But since, if you guys could see, it's fluffy right here. So I don't think it's going to leave those streaks. I think it's going to be really good. So yeah, I got that one. And then I got another foundation. This one doesn't say anything, but yeah. Another foundation brush. And then I got this one either. But this is more like a precise blush brush. So if I want to put it on precisely and then blend it out with another brush. And then here's another blending brush. And this one is a chisel fluff. I'll probably, I got this one for mostly to um, put on. Next one is, is this one. And I got this one. Um, to, as a smudger brush then I got this one I absolutely love this one for um, I already have this one so this one's going in my kit I like to use this as the transition color it just puts it on so smoothly and it's just a great brush and then I got this humongous jumbo powder brush and it's the SS 022 so super big huge 
I'm, I got this to put on the setting powder. And then I got another one. And this one doesn't have a name, but it's that one. And then these two are blending crease. Blending, yeah. This is the C441, and then the C330 is the black. So yeah, just some blending brushes. You can never have too many of those. And then I have a large gel liner. I got this, like if I'm gonna do a smoky eye, I could put it the gel on liner with this and then just blend it out with another brush. And then I got an angle liner. Okay, so that's all my brushes, which was just a lot. And then I got um, I'll go on my liners, my lip liners. This one is called Not Pink, and it's like a light pink color. And then I'll show you guys. This one is, oh yeah, I got one for myself and one for my kit. Another Not Pink, and then this is Mojave Rock. This I would use for like a nude or a brown one, depending on the color. Then I got this one, Milk Chocolate, a little bit darker. And the last one is a red. And then I got the mascara. It's a volumizing mascara as well, and it's in black. So that's their mascara. So I'm gonna try that out, see how it works. See how I like it. After I went to Crown, I went to City Color. This is their little cute black bag. And I got um I got my daughter's lip um they got like a little cute heart palette. Um I already gave it to them though and they're playing with it, so I can't show you, sorry. But um they also had lipsticks and lip liners there, so I got those there too. Okay, so the first one is a bronzer, and it's a little bit on the darker side, and it's a matte bronzer, and this is from their B Matte Bronzer Collection, and this is the color, so yeah, as you guys can see, it's like super dark than the other bronzer that I had. And it's brown sugar, that's this color. And then I got more lip liners. These are still closed, so I'm gonna have to take the time to open them because that'll take too long. Um, are those the names? Yeah, so this is Salmon. Salmon, Salmon, Salmon. Oh gosh, so that's like an orange color. Salmon. Salmon. <laughs> Sorry. Can't talk today. I told you. This is ultra pink. And the last one is Camilla. So that's Camilla. It's like a, let's see if I can put them side by side. It's a little bit lighter pink. And then I got Felicia. Felicia. Bye, Felicia. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so funny. Okay, so yeah, this is like. So yeah, that's the color. I should take these out. I will take these out because these are sort of hard to see what they are. So this is by Felicia. I'm just kidding. It's just Felicia. So as you guys could see, that color. And. They should have a by Felicia lip lip color. I would totally buy it. Hashtag by Felicia. Just kidding. This one is oh my gosh. They're all sticking to me. Okay, cappuccino. So this is a brown color. And the last one I got was gosh. 
Shanisi. You guys could read that. I think it's Nisi. So yeah, that's the lip color. And it's like a bright pink, so pretty, love it. You guys know I love pink. I think I have too much pink. No, a girl can never have too much pink. Okay, so that's all I got from City Color. Now I'm gonna go on to the bags. I mean, the like big bags, like this big bag. Yay, I'm so excited. So I only got one awesome thing from Sugar Pill that I've been wanting forever. So excited to finally get it. <gasps> dun, 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 dun. The Pro Palette. Oh, I'm so excited. I've been wanting this palette forever. I am definitely gonna open this bad boy up so you guys could see how beautiful this palette is. Oh everybody has it oh everybody has it and it's so cool because now if we run out now that we have this awesome pro palette if we run out of any of the colors all we have to do is buy the pan and we could refill it ah, so these are the awesome colors oh i'm so excited okay so let's start off with oops over here Okay, on mine it's backwards. Okay, so this one's Acid Berry. Then the blue one's Velocity. The orange one up there is fl Flame Point. Then Love Plus is this red one. This blue is Moki, Moki, something. Okay, then 2 a.m. is the purple. Then we'll go over here to the yellow. That one is Butter Cupcake. Then, um, I'm confused. Oh, it's right here. <laughs> I was like, I'm confused. Okay, so this one is Better Cupcake. Then Dolly Pop. Then After Party. Then this white one is Toko. Midori. Midori. And then Poison Plum. Okay, so those are my 12 pan eyeshadow pro palette. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, I'm so excited. This, I've been wanting it. And I was just, when I went to IMAP, I was like, they're probably going to be sold out. And one good thing, there was no line. I couldn't believe it. There was no line at Sugar Pill. I was like, oh my gosh, it was out of control. So I was so excited. So yes, no, I have it and it's mine forever. Yay. Okay, so I got that. And the next one I went to was Sigma. So cute, right? Sigma. Okay. And all I got there was their um, 2X Sigma Spa Glove. So, oh goodness. So, yes, I'm so excited I bought the glove. And this is like a necessity, like no joke this glove right here because it's so hard to wash and make sure to deep clean the brushes so I'm so excited I'll be able to use this oh yay yeah place that I went to was Violet Boss isn't their bag so cute her is always talking about them she works their booth and I only got three things from there well actually I got more but my daughters have the other headbands that I got so this is the cute little headband I had to buy because they give you one but I bought the others because of my daughters because they need one and so I bought two more and they gave me they were like a she gave me for a dollar so I got this super cute bow bracelet isn't that cute I love it and it's the stretchy kind so you could just uh, take your hand out and yeah and then everybody talks about the Violet Secret Weapon 4 Loose Pavement and Glitter Adhesive. So I bought their Glitter Adhesive. Everybody is always talking about how awesome it is, so I definitely had to buy it. Okay, the next thing I'm going to show you is from Nigel's Beauty Emporium. 
Yay. So they gave a cute, humongous, reusable bag. I'm so excited with these bags. Gosh. So at Nigel's, I got uh, these eyelashes were a dollar each. Isn't that a great buy? So I'll show you rather quickly the eyelashes I got. So I got a total. 1, 2, 18, 17, 18. I got a total of 18 lashes. So hopefully this will last me until next time. That's no, it will. But um, I'll just have to buy some online or somewhere. Um, so yeah, I'll just quickly show you them. So these are the 138. Those are the 138. These are the 415s. Pretty. I got different because I don't know what kind of uh, clients I'll have, what kind of they'll and I got the 119 and I got um usually I got two of lashes if I really like them so I got two of these 119s and then I got a 46 two of those so those are the 46 see they're full but they're a little bit on the natural side and then I got 119s these are the 61s, 42, 42, those are the 42, 42, these are the 747, extra small, so these are just like, if someone like doesn't like lashes too much, they want to make it look natural, but not as dramatic so those are those lashes I got two of those I got the 138 the 505 I got two of those these are just long and they're a little bit thinner then the 415s I got another 505 the 117s I got two of those so yeah, those are the lashes, and then I wanted to get a Z palette. I got one of these. Um, I still need to figure out what I want to do with them. I think I'm going to empty out um, my Mac, and you know how they have that recycle program? So I think I'll do that, and then I have the little things inside. And then I got a Paw palette. Oh, I absolutely love my paw palette i got the i have the bow one that i got last year and then this year i just wanted a rectangle teal one isn't it so pretty so that's the color and then it has this protective thing in the front so when i'm ready to use it and what i love about these is that they're so comfortable and they're just like a necessity when you go on a job and you look so much more professional when you have this instead of like you know one of those little things so oh and I got some wands for 250 and then this I got because when I depot my lipsticks I need something to put them in so yeah I got that and that's everything that I got at okay so the next place I went to was jcat and you guys know I love jcat so I got first time I show you is the pro makeup brush so um, that's their brush and it's a precision liner I saw this so I was like oh that'll be a good eyeliner just you know to try so I got so many eyeliners and the next thing they're sort of like the lip cards um, and they had fun colors so I was excited that they have that at JCAT you guys know how much I love JCAT okay so this one is and these are from their wonder lip paint line and this one I don't think it says a name Oh yeah, it says. So this is second impossible thing. 
and this is like an orange orange red color I can't wait to try them on I'll definitely be trying them on and showing you guys a picture and this is the chess desire cat that's like a fun purple and the next color is Mimsy and it's like a nude color it's brown and then I got this one and it's called splash and it looks sort of like a gray gray blue color and then the last one is like a hot pink color and that is by the by so pretty I cannot wait to try them and then and they have really great deals I think they were for for the lip tars their lip paint I think they were four for five or something like that or three for six three for ten yeah I said sorry I don't remember oh and I forgot to show you this one I got this one it's like a super pink cute color it's underland so that's that one next I'll show you the lip liners they have like awesome deals so I got and the last place that I went to was friends beauty I absolutely love this place so they had um a couple of things that i wanted to try out well they had two very important this is the color swatch duo from what is it veramona so that's the packaging and this is so great for a makeup artist because on the inside it has so this is used to switch your colors so you don't have to clean your brush out um, completely you just run your brush across this and it cleans it out and you don't have any residue from any other brush so this is great for when you're on set or doing makeup for anybody and then in the middle is the lady said that we could wet it and it stays wet so I think that's so awesome then the next thing I got for my kit was the beauty blender so I got two of those and then on the bottom you guys could see I got the um, the their cleaner and I've heard that it's so awesome so I'm gonna try that too for regular brushes as well and then I got I needed another one of these so I could depot my lipsticks that I just got and this is from Vuset I guess that's the name so yeah and these are really easy to use because all you have to do is put it in the put it in the microwave um, to melt your lipsticks and then um, they come out like super like flat like so pretty so yeah that's the container okay so the next thing that I got at Friends, the very last thing that I'm going to show you is my most important one. Like I've been wanting this for years. Since I've started going to IMATS, I've seen this item and I've been loving it. So I, I absolutely needed to get it and I'm going to come right back and show you guys. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys my train case yay i'm so excited i know you guys can't see very well okay so it's a little bit messed up but whatever just bear with me okay so i'm so excited to show you guys it comes with these little buckles right here and then when you open it up i have three things that look like this and then I could open them I probably put like if I don't depop them I could probably put my lipsticks in here or something um, or I could put my brushes 
different brushes I could put like face brushes all in one or something like that and they stick just right up there you guys could see it's a little bit crooked so sorry maybe if I so crooked but whatever you guys get it okay so then I got this one has like a little hole in the front, so I would think this is like to carry tissues or something. And I came with so it came with these three up here, and then it comes with one, two, three, four. So it comes with this one, and this one has a hole on top, you guys can see that. And then this one is another one I could probably put like my foundation in, all face products, you know, different things. And this one has a hole in the middle, so the tissues go right there. So yeah, and I'm going <clears throat> After I put everything that I want in here, I will definitely give you a more detailed look of what is all in here. And then this comes down and it has these. Okay, so I guess I'll just have to hold it down. You guys could sort of see it. So it has these um, different little compartments. I already put some stuff in here and I'll just need a I need buy a label maker so I could label everything. And so it has so it has four on each side and then it also has like I put a towel in here. This thing opens on the flap. It has like a little opening as well. So yeah when I am <laughs> when I am done with my so when I package everything and I have it all ready for you guys to see, I'll definitely give you a more detailed look. But I'm so excited. So I will see you guys later. And thank you so much for watching my video. Bye, guys.